Hello and welcome once again to Dukescopy TV, I'm Ben Jones. The largest economy in the Eurozone had its ZEW Economic Sentiment Index data released today. It's dropped quite significantly, so joining me on the line to analyse the impact of this figure is Andres Fuente from the OECD. So Andres, if we can talk initially about German ZEW data that has been released. It's fallen to 46.6. Now, a fall was expected, but this has been quite substantial, especially considering that levels were nearing 62 two months ago. What's your reaction to this figure? What do you think could have possibly caused this? The, the new figures uh, remain consistent with continued expansion and even with um, accelerating growth in Germany. Um, it is true that um, the responses have not been quite as positive as in, in the previous months, but they remain positive. Most respondents expect a continued improvement um, in the economic uh, situation uh, facing uh, German firms. So uh, the overall picture remains positive. Why this small deterioration, why this why significant deterioration, as you say, um, one could point to some um, some weakness that we expect in uh, some emerging economies, um, some risks also surrounding China. Um, this could have uh, damped future expectations. But we also need to bear in mind that the ZEW indicator tends to be quite volatile. And so one should not overinterpret one month's data. So do you think this figure mimics the current performance of the German economy? We've seen recent annual GDP growth rate figures hover between 0.9% and 1.3% for the past few months. So are there any indicators of things slowing down at all? Or do you see Germany continuing with this economic growth? I do think that um, the responses uh, reflected in the indicator give a fair picture of the economy, which, which, which is positive. Um, the indicator continues to point towards marked growth and even accelerating growth um, at a modest speed, um, but um, a continued improvement is in the pipeline. And finally, the ZEW current conditions data has been released as well. It's at 51.3. This figure's remained at 50 and above for a while now and isn't sliding down like the economic sentiment index. Is this what you expected? This was to be expected. We've seen um, favorable data coming in in recent months about um, industrial orders, industrial production. Um, the EFO index has also been positive. So this is indeed, this points to, um, uh, to, this, to, to, the, to the good shape of, of the German economy at present. Andres, thank you very much for talking to us today. That's all we've got time for. Stay tuned to Dukascopy TV though, as for the rest of the week, we'll be bringing you plenty more updates and exclusive interviews.